effort today. Vaccination efforts continue here in Minnesota as a new group has the chance now to get the coronavirus vaccine. Teachers Te and child care workers are now able to get the shot. Our Bill Keller has more from St. Paul. Yeah, Minnesota health officials say the goal is to eventually get this vaccine distributed through things like pharmacies and primary care providers. But until then, the state continues trying to use a variety of different approaches. In fact, this time of year, the Roy Wilkins Auditorium normally hosting everything from cat shows to roller derby. But for the next five days, this will be converted into the latest pop-up site to vaccinate about 15,000 frontline workers. Starting later today, teachers and child care workers, they will show up for a pre-scheduled appointment to receive their first dose of the COVID vaccine. Now everyone will get a fresh mask and have their temperature checked before meeting with a nurse at one of 36 vaccination stations. National Guard members also on hand, assisting those health care workers, trying to make sure that everything is running smoothly. This is a pilot event and we're going to learn from it and kind of learn as we go and We'll adapt things as we need to throughout the day tomorrow and throughout the weekend. Now, after getting their shot, each person will then go into a special room. They'll sit down and wait to be observed for about 15 minutes. They just want to make sure that everything is going okay and you have no reaction. Patients will be receiving the Moderna vaccine, so in 28 days, they'll come back for their second dose. But it is important to note this is not open for the general public. Only those teachers and child care workers who are contacted to set up their appointment in advance. In St. Paul, Bill Keller, Fox 9.